Welcome back, everybody, to Uncharted 4, episode what, 3? Uh, so we're on, like, 4, normal life. Yo, this would have been crazy if this was episode 4, but... Uh... Alright, but just a spoiler ahead, Uncharted, no, um, Did You Become Human? Next episode is coming up today. Hey, if you want that double upload... Be sure to watch this video and hope please like, but still we get in that double upload. Yeah, we get in that double upload. <clears throat> Mind your big this. brother some years back. <laughs> Yee. Yeah, one of the stranger things I've collected along the years. Spanish doubloon found in a German U-boat in the middle of a jungle. Who would have thunk? Sir Francis Drake takes a bullet for Sully. Look at us. Shambhala. <laughs> Miss you, pal. Sir Francis and his elaborate puzzles. Now this was a crazy ride. Hmm. Another lifetime, Chloe. Not really my style anymore. Yeah. Here they come. Take cover. I'm surrounded. Bullseye. Business. Take that. Let him flank you, Nate. Yeah, bring it. And that. Eat plastic. Gotcha. Hey, Nate. Are you coming down to eat? Yeah. Yeah, I'll be right there. Like a pro. So long. Well, that's that. Yeah, I'll clean it up next time. So many men killed each other for a piece of this.
You were up there a long time. Well, I was researching something. Oh, is that what we're calling it these days? I was. Hey, would you mind grabbing the food? I'm just wrapping up here. Oh, yeah, sure thing. Thanks. Probably too long and full of typos, but that's what editors are for, right? <laughs> God, I'm starving. Looks good. Mm-hmm. So, how was your day? What? Hmm? Huh? Got none of that. Oh, sorry. I'm sorry. How was your day? Oh, it was fine. Mm-hmm. Typical day in paradise. Mm-hmm. I, uh, I got to pull a bunch of garbage out of a river. Mm hmm Yes. At least you got to go for a swim. <laughs> Did you find any exciting garbage? Oh, some brilliant stuff. It was a uh, early 21st century truck we got. <laughs> Apparently the natives called it a semi. Oh dear lord. Kind of some, so, some, some boring stuff. But tell me about the article. Well, it started out as this fluff piece about tourism in Bangkok, but I don't think the magazine is gonna like the angle that I'm taking because everyone immediately commented about how rude the smog was, that it was like shock to the lungs, like the second that you got off the plane. So, ah! What? Where are you? I'm um, in... Here, being stabbed with a fork. <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> what? Just keep going. It was, it was interesting. Oh. Yeah. Interesting. What's my article about? What? This one? Mm-hmm. Flights in Bangkok that um, are having troubles with them because the smog and they can't land wow <laughs> right, i'm sorry no it was valiant it i was, was in the really ballpark right in a different state but yeah you were in a ballpark <laughs> jameson asked you about that malaysia job again jameson always asked me about the malaysia job look nate i really think that you should take it you know what i don't want it Really? I mean, he doesn't have the permits. And we agreed we're not going to take that kind of work anymore. It's okay, just not worth it. it. It doesn't sound that risky. All right? If it's just a permit. No way. You could call Sullivan. You haven't seen him Elena, in about two years. Well, could we please drop this? Okay, I just don't want you to not take it because of me. I'm not taking it because of me, okay? I appreciate the gesture. It's just... I'm gonna go ahead and do the dishes. No, stop, I'll do them. No, you did on. them last night. No, you cooked. I clean. It's fine. I mean, at least, at least, uh, let me, let me try to earn it or, or something. Let me uh, play you for it. You'll play me for yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Your little TV game thing. I bet I can beat your high score. You think that you can beat my high score on my TV game thing? Yeah, I think you're scared now. You don't even know what it's called. I don't need to know what it's <laughs> called. I've seen you play. It's right. jumping and running, and I have a natural talent oh, for that. Really? So what do you say, chicken? Is it a bet? Oh, wow. Okay, cowboy. Okay. Watch and learn. Oh, I'm learning all right. Is this it? No, it has to load. Load? Yes. This is taking a really long time. You have no patience. When you turn something on, you expect it to... Okay, there we go. <laughs> Crash Bandicoot. Is there a problem? 
No, no, just, uh, how do you, uh, how do you make it go? Push the start button. I knew that. All right. I got it. Okay, so you want to run towards the camera. Run to the camera. Got it. And the circle button is your spin attack. Spin attack? Yeah, press X to jump. Right. Which one's X? Yeah, right thumb. Okay, run away from the boulder. Why is the boulder chasing me? Just run away from it. I did nothing to this boulder. Did that spinning hurt? Oh, yeah. Way to go there. Not bad, not bad. What is that thing, a fox? A bandicoot. Looks like a fox. It's like a fox in jeans. Okay, grab the fruit. What does the fruit do? A hundred gives you an extra life. A hundred? Who's got time to pick a hundred pieces of fruit? <laughs> Perfect. By the way, foxes can't do this. It's a bandicoot. That doesn't look anything like a bandicoot. Have you ever seen a bandicoot? Uh, no, but I'm sure they don't wear sneakers. Oh, these graphics are pretty good, aren't they? Mm -hmm. Okay, smash the boxes. Why is a fox smashing crates? Bandicoot, and that's just, it's what he does. It's a fox, and it's not very realistic. Watch that pit. Watching it. I watched it. Oh, what happened? You fell in the pit. I don't know. How do I uh, climb back out? You're dead. Well, that's not realistic. I, I would have climbed back out. He should learn to climb. Climbing's always helped me. Last life. You gotta make it count. Oh, I so got this. Oh, that poor fox. Bandicoot. Is that it? You asked for it. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. I practically had it. You can give it another shot. Come on, double or nothing. My car could really use a good cleaning. Really? really? You're gonna start yeah. the smack talk There's now? There's this mode called easy mode. I just switch it. Wow. It's way no, easier on no, Just keep mode. talking. Keep talking. What are you gonna do? I'm, I'm warning you. What are you gonna do? I'm warning you. In real life, what hey, can you do? I'm Show me. You. What can you I'm do in you. real life? What do you think about that? <laughs> <Huh>? <laughs> Hey, are you happy? Yeah, of course. You? <laughs> um. Um? <laughs> really? Come here. Not open yet. We're closed. Come on, man. All right, I'm coming. Coming. Asshole. <sighs> yeah, can I help you? Yeah, I'm uh, looking for my little brother. It's about your height, a little bit leaner. Definitely less gray in the temples. Sam? It's good to see you again, Nathan. God, Sam. Oh, all right, all right, all right. Take it easy, take <laughs> it easy. <laughs> How? How? I thought you... I saw you get shot. Yes, you did. Right there. Huh? Jesus. <laughs> well, the doctors, they... I mean, doctors, they patched me up and they... tossed me right back into the cell. Yeah, but I, I made calls. I, I checked everywhere. I, everything I heard, everything I found, it, it all confirmed you were dead. Well, Nathan, we killed a guard, okay? So they wanted to see me rot in that cell for the rest of my life, and I nearly did. Jesus, Sam, I... Man, if I had known, I, I, I swear to you, I would have come back. You would have come back. I know, Nathan, I know. What's important now, though, is that I'm out. Hey, hey, 
You still with me? Yeah. Need some air. <laughs> You're not gonna pass out on me or nothing, I, are you? I just might. <laughs> it's a lot to digest, you know? But how, how did you get out? When did you get out? How, how'd you even get here, find me? All right, right, right. Slow down. Have a seat. I want to hear about you. Huh? Me? Yeah. So what's to tell? Well, call some of your old contacts. Tell me some pretty crazy ass stories. Oh, geez, what crazy stories? Got shot, hanging from a derailed train in the Himalayas. Yeah, that, uh, that actually happened. Come on, man. What did I miss? Jeez, Sam, where do I start? Start with the best part. All right, you remember the, uh, that beautiful astrolabe that I had that belonged to Sir Francis Drake? Oh, yeah, the, the one that, what's her name, stole in Cartagena? Yeah, Marlo. Yeah, Marlo. Well, I tracked it down, and all I had to do was fake my own death. That sounds easy enough. I mean, what can I say? Another lost city destroyed, and, uh, we made it out alive. Barely. <sighs> Unbelievable. I wish you could have been there. No, it, it's literally unbelievable. You, you tell me you stumble upon yet another archaeological <laughs> gold mine, and somehow you manage to walk away with nothing. Yeah, well, it's a story of my life, I guess. But, you know, I managed to grab a few trinkets here and there. Mm. Paid off the car, the house, the engagement ring, the... Engagement ring? I'm married. I can't believe... Uh, Elena, from the stories, that's my wife. You gotta come meet her. Tonight, dinner, at my place. You're coming to dinner. I can tell her all about you. Shit, I gotta tell her all about you. Nathan, I'm in a lot of trouble here. What? What are you talking about? What kind of trouble? Does the name Hector Alcazar ring a bell with you? Yeah, he's the, the drug lord. Mm -hmm. Butcher of Panama, right? Why? It's a funny story, but... Uh, last year, he was my cellmate. So this is how I got out of prison. Not reading tonight. Samuel, come here. Listen. The guards, they're singing. Eh, well, they're probably drunk. Perhaps. But they are content. How can they be content with their small lives? Their miserable jobs? <laughs> well, I mean. They have wives to go home to. What do we got? Huh? No offense. We have ambition. Oh. <laughs> and when we get out of here, that ambition will take us to places these idiots cannot even imagine. Yeah, well, amen to your optimism. <sighs> what will you do when you get out, Samuel? <laughs> That's if I get out of here. I'm sure you can imagine. I can. But I want to hear you say it. I will find the greatest pirate treasure of all time. Which I am sure you are sick of hearing about by now. Oh, no. The tale of Henry Avery and his 400 million in jewels and gold has... ...become a sweet lullaby for me. Do you really think you can find it? Given the opportunity? Absolutely. <laughs> Ambition. What is that Avery quote?
Holy shit. Los demás están en posición. En camino. Todo va de acuerdo al plan. Fantástico. How long have you had this plan? Since the moment I set foot in this place. Samuel, keep up. We're going to have to move quickly. Holy shit. Pedazo de mierda. Combate a la puerta. Nunca saldrás de aquí. Silencio. Jesus. These men are sadistic. We're doing the world a favor, huh? Here. You'll need this. You remember how to use it. Yeah, it'll come back to me. Abran todas las puertas. Hector. You do that, and you'll start a goddamn riot. <laughs> exactly. Háganlo. The closer. I see. So now what? Estamos en posición. Están listos? Sí. Busquen dónde cubrirse. Samuel, get behind something. What? Why? Just do it. Are you all right? Yeah. Yeah, I'm fine. Estamos bien. Samuel, take cover. Samuel, in a minute, we will either be free or dead. Are you ready?
Tell me how to drink. Oh, no, no, I'm good. I'm better than good, actually. You're dehydrated. Go on, drink. Thank you. So, what's next for Samuel Drake? Huh? Mm. Jesus, what is next? Uh, I'm gonna take a bath. I'm gonna sleep on a real bed. Mm. Maybe find a nice warm body to sleep next to me. Uh, track my brother down. Seems like a pretty good start. Uh, it is. So, uh, how long do you think it will take for you to retrieve Avery's treasure? Uh, I don't know. I mean, I, uh, I get back to the States, I can resume my search. How long? Uh, it's kind of hard to say until I get started. You said you know what it is. Yeah, uh, I do, okay? But, listen, it's, it, it's not like Avery left some map with a big red X on it. Okay, but I've, I've, I've got some very solid keys. Keys. Oh, okay. J just, just wait a minute. Take, 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 hey, take it easy. I like you, Samuel. More importantly, I believed you. That is why you were here. I can, I can get it, okay? I, I just need some time. Tell me, Uncle Gio. You see, the problem is, I'm having all these doubts into my mind. Hector, listen to me. I will find it. I swear. To you. How long? Six months. <laughs> People are lazy. They always ask for more time than they actually need. Three months. Three months is a bad. Three months. Half the treasure. Can you do it? Say it. Three months, half the treasure. Now, if you run or try to hide the treasure or do something really stupid like go to the authorities, I'll know. And when you least expect it, I will be there. At that point, death is not a mercy I will grant you. <laughs> Nearest town. It's ten kilometers in that direction towards the sunrise. <laughs> it's been a while since we've seen the sunrise outside, huh? Vamos. When I find it. Then what? Don't worry. When the time comes, I'll be there to collect. When I swear this, Samuel. Zara lets me go, and here we are. This is bad. We just pick up the trail where we left off, and... Wait, trail? Sam, there's no trail. After Rafe and I escaped, he took his parents' fortune and bought up all the land around St. Dismas Cathedral. We combed that place for weeks. Avery's treasure isn't there. Not that that stopped Rafe. Moron's been digging for years, still hasn't turned up squat. Not really surprised. What does that mean? I well, just, you know, happened to do a little digging of my own. And, uh, I bet your Rafe doesn't have this. It's really amazing what you can find on the internet these days. It's just the St. Dismas Cross. Oh, is it? Because the one we found was broken and hollow, remember? Holy crap, it's still intact. Avery made more than one cross. So whatever was missing from the one in Panama... ...is probably still inside this one. Mm -hmm. Well, all right. Well, where is this? Oh, this exquisite piece is going up for auction in three days at the Rossi Estate. The Rossi estate. Well, you know it. Uh, yeah. 
And how do you plan on securing an invite to an exclusive, heavily guarded black market auction? Well, you don't necessarily need an invitation, per uh, se. Huh? Yeah. And where are you going to get the money to outfit all the high rollers? I could take a second mortgage out on my house, and it still wouldn't be enough to... Yeah, you're going to try and steal it, huh? No. We are. Oh, no. No, man, listen, I'm, I can't. I'm, I'm out. What? No, I, I, I just don't do that kind of thing anymore. Besides, there, there are plenty of other guys that are much more equipped to... I can't believe I'm out. I mean, can't believe I'm here, you mean? With you, in Italy, huh? <laughs> yeah, me either. Just wish the circumstances were less tense, you know? Uh, well. you know the sights are a bit more enjoyable that way. Oh. Uh, so this, this isn't your first time here? No, it's more like uh, third. Had a couple of odd jobs. With Sullivan? Well, yeah. <laughs> okay. Man, there's no way up under that bridge. Well, there's that exposed beam underneath. Oh, you think you can rope it? Do I think I can rope it? <laughs> Watch this. I'm watching. I, uh... I missed. <laughs> yes. ah. See? Yeah, it's not bad. For a second attempt. <laughs> You see that? Oh, like a pro. It's your turn. Okay, so where to next? Hey, bet we can swing off that beam up there. Uh, definitely. Hey, let's switch places. All right, climb over me. I've, I've got a good grip. Okay. Okay, here we go. <laughs> First try. All right, no one likes a show-off. Okay, come on, Nathan. Hey, it looks like you can uh, climb down and make your way over. Right behind you. Okay. attraverso un tubo e forse non potrà più camminare. Ah, bene gli sta. Ehi, hey, è scommesso sulla partita. Inghilterra vincente. Inghilterra, traditore. Ehi, hey, non confondere l'orgoglio nazionale con la realtà. Ok, we're good. Jesus, did you see him? That Renner thug was packing some serious heat. Shut up our guns. Sam, we're gonna pull this off so smoothly we won't need him. You're right. <sighs> All those years. <laughs> it's the little things that you miss the most. Look, there's that window. That should hold.
I want to see if I can swing like Spider Man. I <laughs> get it. All right, come on Spider Man's down. coming out soon though. <laughs> get it here. Because I played Spider Man, but I think I might come out come out soon for the next part. Over here. Yeah, it's yeah tell me about it. <laughs> so, uh, your other wonderful finds. Uh, the ones I missed. He's taking chances. I wish. Elena filmed some of it, but camera didn't make it. That's too bad. I have some drawings, though. When we get back, I'll show you. You have drawings? What, are they up on the fridge or something? No, I, they're good drawings. I can't wait. Ah, this looks promising. I think you mean precarious. Oh, shit! You okay up there? Yeah. Yeah, I'm good. It'd suck if you missed right now. It sure would. But I don't miss. million bucks. Let's go. All right, I'm right behind you. Sully? You know what I love about partying with a bunch of crooks? What's that? Nobody cares if you smoke indoors. <laughs> <laughs> it's been a while. Too long, boy. Oh. <clears throat> you remember my dead brother, right? Victor? I'll be goddamn. Fifteen years. Yep. Good to see you alive, Sam. Mm -hmm. let's, uh, let's try keeping him alive by getting this cross, huh? Yeah, uh, about that. What, what about that? Come on, let me show you something. That's Avery's cross. They brought it out of storage just before you guys got here. They changed the lot order. Take a whole pile of cash to make that happen. All right, well, how long before they start the bidding? 10, 15 minutes tops. Well, There's got to be some way we can grab it. <laughs> there is just a small matter of a few hundred eyewitnesses okay, down there. Okay, okay, but we just need a diversion. Like? Like, um, like I don't know. There's got to be something. Well, if the gods see us <laughs> making for that cross... But they don't see us. Hmm? Jesus, you guys act like you never spend time in prison. If you want something dirty done, then you wait for, for lights, lights out. out. Yeah. Where's that electrical panel for this place? 
ventilation. Electrical. That's it up here. So we just have to climb up there and kill the lights. Grab the cross in the dark. There will be an emergency generator. And that'll give us a few seconds of darkness to work with. Meaning we'll have to be right next to the cross when the lights go out. So there's no way we can get that close without being noticed. Scusate, signore. Mm. Antipasti? Mosa. Hi. How are you? Ciao. Would you focus? The waiter wouldn't get noticed. That could work. Huh? That will work. <laughs> All right. All right, I'll, I'll get to the breaker room. Kill the power. You mean I'm the waiter? You're the best pickpocket. You head down to the floor, keep your eye on the prize, okay? Let us know if anything, uh, pinky goes down. Roger that. All right. Listen, we still got this. Gotta say, Victor, the years have been kind to you. Thanks. I chuck it up to going vegan. Really? I mean, this bounce. Are you kidding me? Hell no. No, no, no. I refuse to believe You see, I thought I had a reasonable grasp. Sell it just through there. Let's go. So this place is fancy. Monsieur Lanza, do you remember us? Magnificent Here we are. It's locked. Shit, it was open earlier. Now what? Can we pick it? No, it's electronic. We're gonna have to find another way in. You see that? Key card, back left pocket. Yep. I'm on it. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You sure you wanna do that? There's a lot of eyes out here. I think I can handle a simple lift. All right. Oh, real smooth. I'm not even trying yet. Yeah, I can tell. doubted me. Pleasure to watch professionals at work. Okay. All right. Let's try this again. We'll still need these. Great. Good luck. We'll be in touch. Hands in the air. Hi, Victor. Hello, Nadine. <laughs> Pleasure to see you again. Only this time, I've got the drop on you. Well, I guess I should be glad that's not a real gun. <laughs> Hardly recognize you out of your fatigues. Yeah. You know how it is. Every once in a while, a job requires us to get all dolled up. Looking sharp, by the way. Not too bad yourself so out of place here. Can't tell you what a relief it is to run into another English speaker. Even if you are American. They'll have to blame my parents for that one. <laughs> I was on my way to the bar. Can I get you something? Yeah, scotch. On the rocks. Be right back. Date? You catch all that? Yes, I did. 
Sounds like that lady's trying to buy you a drink. Yeah, Nadine Ross is buying me a drink. Nadine Ross? Wait, doesn't she own that army for hire? It's called Coastline? Shoreline. Yeah, right. But you had a run in with them. It's putting it mildly. Fortunately, she does not seem to be holding a grudge. I'm good to go here. All right. Listen, we're all set, Sully. You, uh, stay out of trouble, okay? I'll try. You ready? <laughs> yeah, let's do it. Gotta find where the waiters and caterers are hanging out. And lure one out of the kitchen, probably. Then let's go find the kitchen. Man, there's enough food down here to feed a small town. Oh, yeah, they're a full service site. Weddings, bar mitzvahs, black market auctions. Crap. You see a waiter in there? Nah, just more heavily armed goons. This skate wasn't on the blueprint. Unlocked, of course. Okay, plan B. I told you it's locked. Trust, but verify. And it's locked. Right. Fence up there. Here we go. Let there be light. Bad electrical in this joint. <sighs> Don't suppose you brought a f Yeah, that'll do. <laughs> I guess it's always a good idea to bring a smoker along. Unless you need to run. Man, I'm starting to get a little drunk off the fumes in here. Oh, good thing Sully's driving. Maybe the vent access is behind these casks. That's a lot of really rare vintage. Yeah, maybe Alcazar can just settle for some good wine. <laughs> that's something tells me that's not gonna fly. Hey, uh, should we worry that Victor is chatting up Nadine Ross? I mean, I've heard some pretty scary stories about her crew. Yeah, don't worry about Sully. I can talk his way out of anything. There you go. This way. Hey, look, the vents. That's our way out. Yep, let's find something to climb on. Yeah, I got it. No need to give me a hand or anything. I'm holding the lighter. Holding the lighter. We go. Right there. That's smaller than it looked, huh? 
and a lot more dusty. shortage of waiters around here. Dove diavolo si procurano tutta questa roba? Sono pezzi rubati ai ricettatori. Fresh air, here we come. Check this out. See that building with the radio tower? You mean the cell tower? The what? Whatever. Listen, that's the power room. Yeah, you're right. Let's see how we get past this gate. Check it out. Sam, up here. I'll boost you up. All right. All right. Good thing you kept in shape. There you go. Sully, we just got out of the wine cellar. Heading to the power room now. How's it looking? Sully? You there? It must be a bad spot for a signal. Hopefully he's doing okay. Bingo. Found the kitchen. And of course it's locked. Sam, look. Maybe we can use that, find a window, drop into the kitchen. That's a good idea. I'll boost you up and you take care of the ladder. Sera. Ma che sta facendo? Easy on the civilians, Sam. Oi, so he wakes up with a headache in his underwear. We've both been there before, right? <laughs> right. Well, I got mine. You get yours. All right. Okay, let's get to the power room.
Sam, you good? Yeah, these pants are just a little bit too tight. <sighs> yeah, well, that's the style these days. Really? No, oh, we're in Rome. Nah, because we're in Italy. I get it. Sam, you there? Sam? Sully? Great. Okay, just like riding a bike. Several hundred feet in the air. Guys, if you can hear me, I'm just about at the power room. Should be there soon. Ish. <laughs> 